Do you want to know how to design logos like this, this, or even this using AI tools? Today, with the help of AI, you no longer need to hire a designer and spend a small fortune on your logo design. In fact, today in this video, I'm going to show you and review five AI tools that can help you create a professional logo with a small budget. I'll be looking at how easy it is to use. Can you customize it as you wish? The quality of output, of course, the pricing, and some additional features to review these five AI tools. All right, let me get into my screen and show you these tools. All right, the first tool that I want to talk to you about is called Ideogram. And this is an AI image generator that can generate text correctly. That means that this is perfect for logos if you want it to be text-based. Okay, so let's give it a try. And let's just suppose that I have a company called CypherX for the sake of this video. So I'm going to generate logos with this brand name in all of the tools. Okay, so to use Ideogram, it's really simple. You just enter your prompt here, click typography, and then I always use one-on-one -on -one ratio for logo, and then just click generate. And just like that, you have some really cool logos. Um, there's not one that I specifically like, and some didn't spell right, but you can always just regenerate. So let's try that again. So I've generated a few, and I think this one looks pretty cool. And what you can do now is that you can download it as your logo, but just keep in mind that this will be low resolution, unless you upgrade to a pay plan or you use other tools to make it to a vector. So if you're interested in seeing a tutorial about how to turn a logo like this into a vector, please leave a comment down below. So here's my overall rating for Ideogram. For the price, it's 10 out of 10, but it doesn't have many customization options or additional features because it is not made for making logos. So this is great in my opinion, but you don't have many options to customize. Okay. Let's move on to the second tool. Tool number two, Fiverr Logo Maker. Now, Fiverr, as we all know, is a platform where we can go hire some freelancers. You can hire your graphic designers or web developers. But many of you might not know that they have a dedicated platform to make logos called Fiverr Logo Maker. I've included the link down below if you want to try it. So as you can see here, it says, all of Fiverr's logo maker suggested designs are based on the beautiful work of top freelance designers on Fiverr, matched and adjusted to your needs with the power of artificial intelligence. So this is a really good combination with both AI capacities and the human input. Fiverr logo maker is really straightforward to use. First, add your brand name, then add your slogan if you have one, click on next. Select your industry, add some elements if you want, click on next, choose the logo style, define your brand's personality, and click make my logo. Then you will have all these logos to choose from. When you select one, you can see how it will look like on some business cards or some of the socials. And you can also choose some variations on the left-hand side. If you want, you can also customize this design. This page here will allow you to change the color, the name, the slogan, shape, background, and layouts. And once you're happy with the design, then you can click on buy and download. And these are the packages. So if you just want the logo, then you can choose the essential. But if you want other branding materials, then you can choose the professional or unlimited plan. So these are my overall ratings for Fiverr Logo Maker. I find it really easy to use and you have a lot of customization options. The quality of output is relatively good as well. The price is maybe a little bit pricey for some people, but for the features you get, I find it a really viable option. So overall, I would say this is suitable for those who want to be able to customize your logo and also have a balance of AI and human inputs. Next up, we have LogoAI.com. So this is 
a website that's dedicated to make logo and some brand identity designs. So to use it, it's really simple. Click on let's make a logo, answer some questions, including your logo name, slogan, select your industry and choose color schemes, choose the styles. As you can see here, you have some examples of the brand names we all know. Then click generate. So I find it really easy to use. And also I liked how it guided us to create a logo with all these other examples so we can imagine how we like. So the results that it generated are not really my favorite, but let's just choose one. And let's go with this one. So what you can do, you can preview or edit or just buy as this. I'm going to click on edit. On the left hand side, you have some simple suggestions and you can click on the things you like. For instance, I really like this one. And then you can also change the layout like this. Quite a few options here. If you don't like the fonts, you can change that as well as well as color. So really a lot of options here, which is great. And once you're happy, you can click on buy. Then here is the pricing plan. You have basic, which is a logo only, and you have other plans that include more high resolution or some vector files and so on and so forth. So I feel like the results can vary because the last time I tried, I wasn't really happy with the results, but this time I find it pretty good to have options for customization and things like that. And here is my ratings for LogoAI.com. Uh, it's really easy to use. I really like the guidance. You have lots of customization options as well. The quality of output is relatively good. The pricing may be on the more expensive side, depending on your need. And it does have a few additional features. So overall, it's 7.7 .7 out of 10. And if you want to try this one, the link is down below as well. Tool number four, we have taylorbrands.com. Taylor Brands offer a full toolbox for small businesses and individuals to easily create your logo designs. It also offers other services for small businesses, including a business logo, domain name, business email, or digital business card, or even if you want to register an LLC, they also have a service for that. So let's have a look insert your brand name, then click on get started. Next, choose the service or products your company offers. Click on next, enter your industry or some other descriptions if you have. Choose your biggest motivation here and choose what stage your company is at. Then for this question, if you just want to create a logo, choose logo and branding. Click on next answer this question as well and here it will list all the services they have but if you just want a logo then click on create a logo choose your logo type it can be icon name based or initial based if you click on icon based and you can choose an icon so this is pretty good because they have a variety of icons here you can choose your icon here. I find this really good. Choose three styles you love. Click on next. And your logo is being created. Here are the results. So, so far, none that I like. Maybe this one is quite nice. And what's good about this also that you can see on a, a website, a business card or social media or some merchandise as well. You can also click on customize. Here you can change the fonts, your icon, the color as well, the layout, just like the other one that we saw. And once you're happy, click on finish. Click on finished. And it will direct you to this page here. And when you click on download, you have all these pricing plans so since taylor brands not only have logos they also have other small business options they have a subscription rather than just a one-time payment 
So this is one of the cons I find for Taylor Brands because if you just want a logo, then you need to take a subscription. But one thing that you can do is that you can pay for monthly and choose for the basic plan. So you have your logo and full ownership of your logo. And then once you download your logos and all the files, then you can cancel, cancel anytime. Okay, so for Taylor Brands, I will give it 8 out of 10 for ease of use. It has also lots of customization options. The quality of output is relatively good as well. The price is good because it's less than $10 for the logo. And you also have lots of additional features. So overall, I give it 8.1 out of 10. I would say that this is ideal for someone who needs a complete brand identity. Uh, but maybe not the best for those who just want a logo because then you need to take a subscription and then cancel. But on the flip side, it's also cheaper than other options that I presented here. And as always, the link is down below if you want to try it. All right, our last logo design tool is called Luca. And this is one of the most powerful tools that I've tried for AI logo designs. To get started, it is also really simple. Just insert your brand name, click get started, pick your industry, pick some logos you like so it knows what kind of styles you are looking for, click continue, pick the colors, pick some symbol types. So I think this is kind of like keywords for your company. Then you have these logos to choose from. And I think for me personally, they look the best among all the other tools that we tried. Let's go for this one, hit customize. And what I find good about Luca is that you have even more customization options. So you have the color palette, you have the layout, and you can also choose more ideas. So the varieties here is just amazing. You can change the background name, add a slogan, change the symbol as well. So this is really good because I like the gold, but maybe I'm not a big fan of the symbol here, but you can easily change that and the container as well. You can also click on brand kit to preview it. So they have everything that you can imagine. You have the logo files, the website for your print shop, business cards, email signature, and other offers. Also for social media, they have everything that you can possibly need. Business docs, marketing. So this is really comprehensive and I think this is really ideal for those who just want a one stop for all service for all your visuals. Okay, let's go back to the logo. And once you're happy, you can click on download. So click on this option here and then you will come to this pricing page for the basic logo package, it's $20, but this is a low resolution file. For a more high resolution, high quality file, it's $65. And if you want all these brand kit and all these things that I just showed you, then you do have this pricing plan that costs $96 per year. Overall, I would say that Luca is the best among the five that I tested. It's really easy to use. You have tons of customization options. The quality of output is really good. The pricing may be on the more expensive side, but you get what you pay for. And it does have lots of additional features as well. So overall, it gets an 8.2 out of 10. And what I like about Luca is how high quality you can get for the logos. And also you have lots of branding assets if you want. Okay. To end this video, let me just show you a table with all the ratings I gave for all these tools. To summarize, if you're looking for an easy tool to use and a tons of customization options and branding options, I think Luca is the best. For just a simple logo design, maybe go for Fiverr Logo Maker because you don't have all these other options, but the result is also quite good. And if you want other small business services such as email or website, then definitely go for Taylor brand. But if you just want a simple logo for free, then you can go for ideogram. 
I hope you found this comparison helpful, and I hope you find the tool that you need for your logo design. And as I said, all the links are down below if you want to try them. So if this video helped you in any way, definitely let me know by smashing this like button, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out. And if you haven't already, watch this video about Ideogram where I will show you how step-by-step -step to use this platform. And that's all for today. I'll see you in the next video.